For this recording, I'm going to show you how to apply Simpson's rule to evaluate the integral of square root of sine x from x equal to 0 to pi over 3 with n equal to 6 strips. First, we must find the width of the sub interval. So this notation is h here, which is equal to b minus a over n, where b is the upper limit pi over 3, a is the lower limit 0, and n is equal to 6. That will give us pi over 18. And then we are going to construct a table. The table will start from x equal to 0, then increase by h, which is pi over 18, then increase by h again, I get 2 pi over 18, then increase by h, I get 3 pi over 18, and then 4 pi over 18, 5 pi over 18, and then finally 6 pi over 18, which is pi over 3. To evaluate the y, I can use the calculator to help me. So let me call my calculator. And now I'm going to first set the calculator to radial mode first, since any trigger function will require radial mode for computation. Shift mode to set up and select 4 for radial mode. Then I'm going to set up table mode 3 for table here. And I enter the function which is square root of sine x of our x and the close bracket and press equal. The starting value of x will be 0. The end value of x is pi over 3. So I press shift pi divided by 3. And the step size is the width which is pi over 18. Then I'll get a table which says that when x equals 0, y equals 0. When x equals pi over 18, y is 0 0.41671. So we can fill up this value. These are the first four values of y. And then I'll continue to fill in the next value of y. After I finish fill out the value of y, I'm going to label this y as y0, y1, y2, y3, y4, y5, and y6. According to Simpson's rule, the integral of square root of sine x from x equal to 0 to pi over 3 is approximately equal to h over 3 multiplied by first y and the last y, y0 and y6 add together, then 4 times all the odd position y, which is y1, y3, and y5, then plus 2 times all the even position y, which is y2 plus y4. Notice that y6 has been included in the first term. I know that h equals pi over 18, and then divide by 3 again, and y0 and y6, which I'm going to use some color to integrate that. y0 is here, y6 is here, and this will give me 0 plus 0 0.93065. Then plus 4 times all the odd position y, which is y1 plus y3 plus y5. So I'm going to copy them 
here as 0.41671 plus 0.70711 plus 0.87524 then followed by 2 times then the even position y which is here y2 and y4 so and right here which is 0 0.58482 plus 0 0.80174 so let me use some color to integrate where are these points y0 and y6 will be here y1, y3 and y5 are here and y2 and y4 are here and if you press the calculator you find that the answer up to 3 decimal place is 0 0.681 that is the end of this recording